Now showing through September 18th, Savage Gardens, the real and imaginary world of carnivorous plants, is part of the Arboretum's super-sized summer. This exhibit has a combination of elements and contributors that have a common theme, exploring the world of these unique and fascinating plants. The first and most high-profile part of the exhibit are four giant sculptures that are the work of Ohio artists from Torque Incorporated. Their creative genius teaches visitors of all ages about carnivorous plants on a grand scale. The only outdoor sculpture, the trumpet plants, can be seen on the island right outside the visitor center. They range in height from 9 to 16 feet and weigh in at 100 pounds each. To replicate the beautiful coloring of the live plant, a tricky powder coating process was used, with green at the bottom, blending and transitioning into red at the top. In the visitor center, the round leaf sundew is fabricated from aluminum and resin and has more than 350 feet of fiber optic cables inside to light its 500 plus tentacles for dramatic effect. Including a stem with a flower at the top, this sculpture is 18 feet tall. Surprisingly, the sundew only weighs about 75 pounds. Also in the visitor center, the Venus flytrap is made of aluminum, stainless steel, and silicon rubber. The entire structure weighs more than 600 pounds. It has a fully enclosed hydraulic unit that is connected to interactive buttons at each of four corners. When visitors push the buttons, the fly traps buzz and snap shut, illustrating how this carnivorous plant traps its prey. Follow the signs out of the visitor center and walk through the breezeway to the Snyder Building Conservatory to find the Nepenthes sculpture. It is 13 and a half feet tall, with a base that is six feet in diameter and nine inches deep. It is made of three separate parts that bolt together to form the pod. This design makes it possible to ship the sculpture to various shows around the country. The Nepenthes is an interactive sculpture that visitors can go inside of and see what it's like to be absorbed by a giant pitcher plant. The Savage Gardens exhibit also includes six hands-on interactive stations that are located in the alcove outside the Gift and Garden store, as well as the Snyder Building lobby. Constructed for friendly, pint-sized entertainment, but created with education in mind, kids will never know that they're anything but good summer fun. Rounding out the exhibit are live carnivorous plant displays. Lovingly nurtured by the Arboretum's horticultural staff, these plant displays have been several months in the making. Come and see what real live carnivorous plants look like, many of which are, believe it or not, native to Minnesota. Yeah, you betcha. The super size fun goes on all summer long. You'll want to see this amazing kid-friendly exhibit firsthand. Come, play, and spend the day through September 18th.